I'm happy, I'm blessed, I'm free. I'm happy, I'm blessed, I'm free. Do I have sound now? Just gonna wait and see if I have sound. While I do that, I'm gonna go get my coffee. So guys, we talk about freedom. We talk about staying free, as free as you can be in this society, right? That's what we talk about. Hey, Lauren, good morning. Hey, do I have sound? Because I did this before, I didn't have sound. I had to delete that one. Meanwhile, I'm going to grab my coffee and enjoy my coffee while I wait for everybody to get on. Hi, Lorraine. How are you? Thank you for being my friend. Thank you for being part of my family here on the YouTube. I love YouTube. I honestly do. I love this platform. Why? Because it is the fastest growing. It's better than Instagram, Facebook, TikTok combined. So God is good. He put me on the best. And it's continuing to thrive. Cheers to that. Cheers to being a unicorn and using your unicorn gifts. <laughs> I've always been this way. So being me, actually, God put me on YouTube so I could just be me and not worry about what other people think and finally put that those devils to bed, right? Cheers, one of a kind. Cheers to those people who are one of a kind and not afraid to say it. Not afraid to be it, right? I know we're kind of rare, but anyways... What's your weather like there in this crazy time? Right now, the weather is 44.6 degrees and rainy. So this is what I have. I have this, this uh, flannel, L.L. Bean. This is L.L. Bean. My boots, L.L. Bean. They're, they're for warmth because <laughs> I freeze in this weather. And then I've got my L.L. Bean Gore-Tex jacket that uh, is Gore-Tex. So that's why I'm wearing this worn shirt. I'm matching. I look like a lumberjack when I'm in this. My husband did the lumberjack song. I'm a lumberjack. Baby. I said, honey, I don't need that in my head before I go live. I'm just saying. So he went to shower. He goes, you want me to show you that video? I said, no. <laughs> welcome, welcome, welcome. Hi, everybody. I'm assuming you can hear me. A little dry creek ranch. This is the second time I've had to load this. So hold on to your hats. I don't know what what causes that. I don't know. I'm not I'm not demonizing it though because the enemy has no power, and I don't I don't. It's eleven eleven. Oh, it's eleven eleven. So guys, our time here is short. Thank you. Five by five. You can hear me fine. Cheers. It's eleven eleven a.m. right now. Shout out to the miracle testimonies y'all have been sending me. Oh my gosh, so amazing. Uh, the healing they got. Guys, if you need prayer, put it in the comments down below. I will pray for you. And when I, re I will reply and say, I'm praying, look for your miracle. Got to look for your miracles, guys. And you need to share your testimony. You need to praise him. When you see a miracle, once you've experienced supernatural miracles, you need to tell people. You need to not be afraid to talk about Jesus Christ and how good he is in this crazy day. This is the war. You know, the enemy would rather you just not talk about him, right? He hates it. I do. But so anyways, I've got that ready to go on the back couch because we have a chiropractic appointment. This is the last step to my healing. I'm assuming this is the last day where I will have any sniffles, any coughs, anything. I am done with this. This was uh, God ordained. So I would rest. That's that's the story. And I'm sticking to it. It's God ordained. So I would rest more. I did. I rested. I'm ready to go. God, I'm ready to go. Let us go. Let us go. Let's go. Let's go get our money so we can run. <laughs> Guys, it's just getting, a, the craziness has amped up. The rumors have amped up. The potentially lies, but I'm not calling anybody out because there's a lot of people with a lot more money, a lot more resources than me, who've obviously been set up to guide you a certain way. Okay? You're being manipulated, right? But it's... Y'all know I love what I love and I love the freedom and I love, I do not agree with everything that's going on. You know that, right? But I believe Jesus Christ more than I do anything that's been formed against you because there has been things formed against you and it's already done. There's nothing anybody coming in is going to do to change that overall system other than they can manipulate you, lie to you and convince you it's good for you and for everybody. It's good for the world. I'm just saying, um, be careful. I'm not going to talk about it <laughs> here. I'm not too, 
Uh, no, I'm not talking about that here. I'm too smart for that. So let's talk about the goodness of God. Let's talk about the Iraqi dinar because there's a channel out there with 100,000 subscribers, Mark. I love you because you told me it can be done even if you just talk about the dinar. I don't want to talk about everything else. You have a job interview tomorrow. Please pray for me. I am without work for a year and a half. Oh, Lord. Cat Condo. Lord Jesus, I ask I ask you to give her favor, 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 favor. Even if there's better candidates, Lord, you are going to highlight her. She's going to have the best interview she's ever had. It's your favor. But Lord, right before I, I, I speak over her, her mind that she would not be anxious. Amen. I speak peace, calmness, confidence in that job interview in Jesus's name. You know, she needs provision right now. And Lord, we live in this real world and you need multiple streams of income. I had somebody comment. Well, how are you talking about freedom if you ain't free? Because you have two jobs and your husband has two jobs. And I'm like, do you live in this world? What do you live off the government? I didn't say, do you live off the government? I didn't say that. I thought it. <laughs> Anyways, I, I was up a lot last night again, and and but I feel good. Can you tell? I think I sound better. I think I am better, but I need coffee, one of a kind. Uh, guys, I don't have a lot of time with you this morning. I'm sorry. I don't have a lot of time. Thank you, Holy Spirit, for always being with me to deliver me. I was worshiping this morning before I got on. Um, I wanted to wear, I'm feeling a little, I'm feeling a little snarky. I wanted to wear my Northeastern firearm shirt, but I didn't. I was going to send a message, but I don't know if I got rid of that. I don't know. I don't know where it is. So I found this one instead, and I thought about my Gore-Tex, and then the outfit was formed. And it's still an iconic time. I'm glad you're with me. Anyone else heard the U.S.? Yes, that Karen, that's what I just referred to. I can't go there here. Become a Miracle Manifestation member, and I will talk about that on the 15th. Now, I want to throw something out there. If you guys need me to do a Zoom for taxes, I could do the same thing. If you want me to do that, let me know. Because you need to get caught up. Because right now, we don't know, right? Nobody's been, <laughs> nothing's been revealed. I'll believe it when I see it, right? And the person they're using to tell you that, you know, he's been set up really, really well. So he's either really, really good and really, really right and really, really favored by them, or he's set up to manipulate you. Oh, no. The jury's out on that. I'm not casting dispersions on any human on the planet. I'm just saying we are under crazy times where the truth is. It, it's not, this is the truth I know. This is the only thing I count on is that God is good and you're in the secret place. So that's a worldly question. I ain't getting involved. I don't want to offend anybody. I don't want to take sides because God knows 30 million followers, 30,000. I would be a fool, you know, and he just, See, he sues people <laughs> that say anything about him. I ain't touching that. I'm going to be like, he's like a king in my opinion. Not in God's kingdom, but in the world's kingdom, he's king. Right? You don't take shots at the king. <laughs> That's called wisdom. <laughs> Good. I'm really positive too. I think miracles are circulating. God has a plan. He's not letting any man know his plan. Supposedly the plan of the, um, I'm not going to even, I can't say that either. So let's talk about God. Oh, God help me. I, 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 this is, I knew it was a trap. Um, you may, if you don't know who I'm talking about, you just don't know and it's okay. And I don't want to talk about it here. He doesn't have a presence here. He doesn't have a presence here. There's a lot of people here that listen to him. There's some solid Christians I've known for years that listen to him. They believe everything he says. Okay. He defends himself very well. I've watched before. He's very smart. He's talking about how much money he's earning because he has to justify now why he has four houses and he's traveling and he's, he's showing it all on his channel. I'm like, is nobody getting it? Anyways, 
I know I got to keep being me. I got to stay in my lane. It's very hard though, because I want to comment, but I can't. It wouldn't be wise, right? Just like there's a lot of reasons why my YouTube channel is still up and a lot of other people's are rebuilding. God was good. He kept me hidden. Guys, just like the lonely, I, I, the, you're not lonely, you're separate. You're separated by God. It's the same thing. You're not, <laughs> you were not ever built to fit in, right? This, this collective consciousness, these two cyborgs of consciousness, you're either plugged into one or the other, it seems like. You don't have to participate. You can still be free. Free your mind and the rest will follow. How do you free your mind? You renew it with the goodness of God, right? I look at Star Wars, right? You remember the great movie Star Wars? I remember seeing that as a kid, knowing, just knowing that it was going to be huge. But what I liked is there was always good versus evil, right? Evil had the power. Good was always fighting back. I'm the good guy, good woman, leading a tribe of misfits <laughs> so we can stay free. Because God gives me my instructions. Every morning, he gives me instructions. This morning, it was miracles, dot, dot, dot. And what did I do? I looked at my phone because I don't look at my phone or I would never sleep. Um, I looked at my phone and somebody said they had, they gave me, they sent me an email and then texted me. And it was a miracle. And she, she took note of the time. She's, she's making note. Guys, when you start tracking your journey with God, like I do, I talked about this yesterday. Um, your life is messy, right? In your Bible, this is this is a time when you need to record what God is speaking to you. If you have to practice hearing from God to hear from Him, I need you to do this. I need you to live in Psalm ninety-one until you, the paper is thin. Just like I was in, I was in restoration since two thousand twelve. I didn't know what was going on. I don't pay. I've never paid attention to anybody other than what God wants me to do. I mean, I was going through my own warfare. <clears throat> so God kept me separate from all that. So I didn't ride that wave of this big wave that a lot of people earn a lot of money because they're on the wave. I'm not on the wave. I'm on my own little wave. I'm in, I'm in the trough. I'm not on the wave. I'm in the trough. Anybody surf? <laughs> I know enough about surfing to do that because I used to, oh, I, I love the water. Right. I love playing in the water. But here, you know, it scares me because it's cold water and cold rain. My least favorite day. That's why I'm wearing orange. I try to be I try to be the sun, you know, be what you need, be what the world needs. The world needs peace. The world doesn't need more lies. In my opinion. The world needs peace. And the numbers don't work. The numbers just don't work. But, but, you know, you lean not on your own understanding and all your ways acknowledge him and he shall direct your paths. There's a lot of way the world can deceive you and make something look real. There's a lot of people believe that aliens exist and that they're, they see videos of them. You know, have you ever given to a movie? Saw the, the, the deception is on. <laughs> deception is. It, it, I've never seen such a time. You can't believe anything you see anymore. Case in point, there's a lot of people that believe, you know, Biden mask. There's people that believe that. I, I don't know. I don't care. Why? I'm here to help you fix your life. And <laughs> no amount of me worrying about that is going to help you fix your life. That is not my mandate. Like I said, I'm not called. Thank God. <laughs> never say never. I'm not called to that to lead in the political sphere. You, you need to pray for all those people that you like that are fighting a battle of evil. It's like a den of snakes. Remember what I said the eagles do? They fly way up. They 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 don't they don't argue with the snakes, right? They fly higher. What did, was my message yesterday? Fly higher. Tune in to the kingdom of God and his miracles and you will forget the world. The world will disappear. This is the the things that you heard last night is a worldly topic. I get it. You love your, I love my country too. I'm hoping something happens. I don't know what the plan is though. And I, and it, to speak on it, 
would would that potential king could look at me as an adversary and then go after me. That would not be smart. Just like I say, don't poke the bears. You don't take shots at people that have that much influence. You don't take, I, first, I try not to take shots of anybody, but it doesn't matter. My mouth has a, When you tell the truth, somebody's going to be offended. Everybody's going to think you're, there's always going to be somebody that thinks I'm wrong. That's the game <laughs> when you're on social media. You need to be able to put up with it. And I can, why? Because I've been, I've overcome a traumatic life. <laughs> I had a lot of drama. I did, I did a short today. Did you see it? It was on trauma. The signs that you had a traumatic upbringing. I mean, I knew it did. <laughs> the signs were like, check, 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 check. Check. It's a chosen. You've chosen. I said I did it so you know you're not alone. Okay, you're not alone. I thank God you're not alone. I understand you. My husband or and I, you know, we deal with the inflation too. We're we're right there with you. We I had to file. I was scared to file my taxes, but by the grace of God, because of the losses he built up through my business destruction. <laughs> You know, I still had expenses, the same expenses I always had. But as the inflation goes up, my expenses go up. So I still have carry forward losses to use for future years of profitability. I was praising God after I filed my taxes. So you got to face your fear and get it done. Get it done. And I'm I'm suggesting TurboTax because they're the big dog in the room. They have the attorneys. If you use their software and you use their client services, you use that and you buy the most expensive package. It's going to be cheaper than any local CPA and they have the big guns to support you. Local CPAs don't. They just prepare your return. It says it right there. They're the preparer. They sign as the preparer based on the information you gave them. And if you're audited, you have nobody to help you. So while you may love your local CPA who's been doing your taxes for 20 years, this is not the time for that. This is the time to have the big guns behind you. I'm just saying, yeah, I know it sounds like I'm paid by, I'm not paid by TurboTax to tell you this. Trust me. They've offered me jobs though, because I understand when their software works and when it doesn't, but they, they, they have enough money to protect you. Thank you, Victoria and Kat. Thank you, Kat. Um, and we're all praying for you, Kat, for your interview tomorrow. You'll have, you have a host of angels. Why? Because we put our angels to work. Through our declarations, you speaking the word of God, when you, I had gotten used to speaking the word of God. Do you hear it out of my mouth all the time? I remember at a Catholic woman's Bible study, this woman came up to me uh, and she goes, I don't understand. And I go, what? She goes, you seem to just, the word of God just keeps coming out of your mouth. I don't understand. How do you do that? I said, I read it. <laughs> So anyways, Lord Jesus, it, I know this is not about me. This cold has warped my, ugh, it's just hard. So I'm open to Job 42 again. We haven't left the restoration. Why? Because restoration hasn't come. The Iraqi dinar has not hit your bank accounts yet, right? Right? So we're going to pound on the doors of heaven. So Job died an old man and full of days. So if you're afraid... Where's your faith? If you're afraid you're going to die, where's your faith? Where's my glasses? <laughs> oh, Lord, I need my reading glasses. Oh. Anyways, so make sure you have the faith that surpasses all your own mind. The reason why it's called faith is because it doesn't make sense to the world. It doesn't make sense to the world why I would go on YouTube. It didn't make sense to the world that I would quit my job and move to Maine, my career, after I got married. It doesn't make sense that God would put me in a direct sales business and say, build it. Right? That doesn't make sense. People thought I was going through a mini midlife crisis. Obeying God will make you unpopular. Obeying God get land you on my on my. Obeying God land you here. Please stay here. Subscribe, tap the bell because you're in the right place because I'll never lie to you.
So I know everybody wants to hear what that message was. That's why they said it. That's what everybody wants to hear. Oh, I hate it when they, you know, when they tell you what you want to hear. You know, they, they show their cards all the time. You just can't read their cards. I can. And so, therefore, it's risky for me. But I think you know my, my take on it by what I just said. Sorry. I'm sorry to be the bearer of that news. God, the truth hurts these days. It's crazy. It really is. It really is beyond crazy at this point. It's like, it's like next level mind warping. That's why you got to renew your mind. I'm glad you're here, right? Because every day, if you get some truth and you listen to my stuff and you, you'll begin to know truth from lies. But if you've been listening to lies for a long time, it's going to be hard, right? I'm not going to lie to you. It's going to be hard discerning God's voice. This is supernatural. The, the fact that I can hear from God, but I was meditating for an hour in the morning, an hour at night. He told me when he came to me and he started speaking to me, he goes, remember, and the stillness is when you hear from me, right? It's kind of like I'm meditating, but I'm not. I'm seeking Jesus. I knew not to meditate on any words that I didn't know because it's a wicked days, right? Trust me, the evil e enemies in full force right now, full force. So if you're feeling like circumstances are going wonky, that's the journey. It's not anything unusual. It really isn't about you. It's about this battle. It's a battle, you know, but as for me, okay, when you're battling, if you're battling, a lot of people are battling Psalm five, verse seven, but as for me, I will enter your house through the abundance of your steadfast love and mercy. I will worship toward and at your holy temple and reverent fear and awe of you. See, <clears throat> lead me, O Lord, in your righteousness because of my enemies make your way level straight and right before my face. My strategies are straight and right before your face. They're straight and right before your face. They don't have you waiting for something to change or waiting for the, it to be revealed to the world. They don't have you waiting for anything. Okay. For there is nothing. Oh, uh, Jesus. This is just me talking to you about God's word. I'm reading from his word. If anybody takes this and title tales on me, it's going to be bad for you because it's just the word of God. I'm not saying anything specific, but God is good. For I swear to God, this is the scripture. God always provides your answer that you need. For there is nothing trustworthy or steadfast or truthful in their talk. Their heart is destruction or a destructive chasm, a yawning gulf. Their throat is an open sepulcher. They flatter and make smooth with their tongue. This is Psalm five. I'm going to, I'm going to give you context. This is the entire Psalm. Cause you always need to look at the context when you open the Bible and you start speaking. Cause I've learned, I've read it cover to cover. I understand the whole council. I've meditated. I've prayed. I've worshiped. I fast all the time. I mean, you don't, I don't need to pr prove my walk to you, but if you continue to watch and you ask for a prayer and I pray for you, you'll see, right? You'll see. So listen to my words, O Lord, give heed to my sighing and groaning. Hear the sound of my cry, my King and my God, for to you do I pray. In the morning, you hear my voice, O Lord. In the morning, I prepare a prayer, a sacrifice for you and watch and wait for you to speak tomorrow. I waited on the Lord for him to speak to me this morning. Do you? Well, why do you think my broadcast is at crazy times? For you are not a God who takes pleasure in wickedness, neither will the evil man so much as dwell temporarily with you. Boasters can have no standing in your sight. You abhor all evildoers. You will destroy those who speak lies. The Lord abhors and rejects the bloodthirsty and deceitful man. But as for me, I will enter your house through the abundance of your steadfast love and mercy. I will worship towards you at your holy temple in reverent fear and awe of you. Lead me, O Lord, in your righteousness because of my enemies. Make your way level, straight, and right before my face. Guys, you and I have a lot of enemies. A lot of enemies. Trust me in this. Okay, we have a lot of enemies. 
For there is nothing trustworthy or steadfast or truthful in their talk. Their heart is destruction. In the parens, it says, or a destructive chasm, a yawning gulf. Their throat is an open sepulcher. They flatter and make smooth with their tongue. Hold them guilty, O God. Let them fall by their own designs and counsels. Cast them out because of the multitude of their transgressions, for they have rebelled against you. No one, no one really knows in this crazy day who's really got a heart for God and who doesn't. You, I don't wear crosses just to make a show. You need to ask yourself. Anyways. <clears throat> but let all those who take refuge and put their trust in you rejoice. Let them ever sing and shout for joy because you make a covering over them and defend them. Let also who love your name be joyful and be in high spirits. Praise you, Jesus Christ. My King of Kings, my Lord of Lords, the one who's always shown me a way out when anybody has come against me. And I've had a lot of them come against me in real life. But this is for the stuff that you can't see. Um, for the Lord will bless the uncompromisingly righteous, him who is upright and in right standing with you. As with a shield, you will surround him with goodwill, pleasure, and favor. As with a shield, you will surround him with goodwill, pleasure, and favor. He has surrounded me with a shield. Goodwill, pleasure, and favor. That's why he brought me the horses. Why? Because I've been obedient, right? I don't have any backing, right? I have never, all you need to know is look at my reputation. I've never gone to jail. I've never been accused of anything other than speeding. Barrel racer, surprise, surprise. And most of my tickets, I had a great driving record. I didn't know it before I got called before this judge. I was scared. Cause I'd had a lot of tickets, but I had gone to court. I'd made time even through my corporate time to go to court and see if the officer showed up. If the officer didn't show up, show up, you know, I won. I knew the system. <laughs> and this judge said to me one time, he goes, you know, I want to speak to you right now. Cause I was humble before that judge knowing that I had sped a lot, got a lot of tickets. <laughs> right. And, and, and he said, you, a lot of your tickets were withheld to adjudication or whatever. It's, I'm not a lawyer, but he said, so when I look at your record, miss, you have an incredible record. I said, really? He goes, yeah, that's the way the law works. He, this judge felt, felt my fear, I think, and was very kind to make me aware of what the law meant. Just like I'm making you aware of the tax laws. And how they're they're the for the benefit of business owners. Even if you have a small home business, that is the best way. Having a small home business, I would champion that all day long. And that's what Jesus Jesus led me into that business. That wasn't anything that was my idea. It was Jesus's. Just like he led me into the dinar. It was not my idea. I'm not that smart, right? It was Jesus's idea. It was the Holy Spirit's idea. Ooh, wear a cross, bear a cross. I've bared my crosses. I have followed him. I, I, I have been through a lot. And I don't have to prove myself to you. You judge a tree by its fruit. I am a truth, facts, and optimism channel. Never lie to you. Now, people, people that are wicked would say, oh, she says it's done. Like my last video. The Lord told me to title it that. Well, you have to, you have to vary up your titles. You can't have the same title all the time. I'm just saying. There's a, there's a reality to this. And he said, did I not tell you it's done? So I had to have the, the courage to title it. It is done knowing I was going to get hate. I'm like, okay, God, I trust you. Whatever. I'll take it. And oh my God, the comments, whatever. I'm being obedient. Either you believe it's done without seeing it. That's, that's what's whittling down the wheat and the chaff. They all rise up together. Either you believe this is done because I told you God said it's done or you don't. That's your choice, right? But I would rather believe God and God didn't tell, God hasn't spoken a word to me, uh, not a word about any of that stuff going on. That's why I hesitate to speak about it. And I don't want to, I don't know somebody's heart. Only God knows your heart. But, but 
just be careful with what you believe. I'm just saying. Because I am going to, that came to me in the middle of the night and it kept me up. Um, and God has put a guard over my mouth to protect this channel. I know I'm not wrong. I know. It is done. I mean, guys, I there is very few times. I mean, I follow the leadership of the Holy Spirit. Anybody who truly does, I try to do it all the time and every day and every way. Because why? Because this is a very crazy world right now, right? And and I have to be careful about it. I'm a talker. And it's very careful. I mean, I have to put up with a lot to be here, right? So now I've got a headache. Now I've got to go because anyway, I apologize that I didn't get the Iraqi Dadar summary done, but I think I needed to address the elephant in the room. We'll see. Time always tells, right? I'm just trying to be a good steward of your time and your attention. I refuse to lie to you or to just agree with a lie because somebody who has a huge following says it. I don't know. I don't know. All I know is even the elect in the last days, even the elect will fall. Be deceived. Even the elect of God. Right? That's why I fast and pray so much. That's why I worship so much because yeah, I was, I was troubled before I got on here because it feels like a trap because somebody like that, if they said one word against me, boom. Now he's owning a production company and all this stuff now. He's becoming untouchable. <clears throat> All glory goes to God on my channel. I don't, I don't think I'm untouchable. I know I'm not untouchable. This is a good product if you're tired. I will be putting the, this in my water bottle. This is does not break your fasting window either. There's not enough calories in it. But don't do it after four or it will make keep you from sleep. And that's when I use the 24K. I, I want to explain the difference. Energize Go does have the equivalent of caffeine in it. So it could make you jittery. But if you get that with your one-click package, set it aside and only use it for certain occasions. Like when you really need it. Like I need it today. I didn't sleep much. I use it early afternoon when I'm not sleeping much. So I'll put it in my water bottle and go to the chiropractor. That's how I use it. 24K is in my afternoon or evening before dinner shakes. Why? It... It, it's only five calories. There's no carbs in it. I don't know how they make, I don't know. I'm not a food scientist, but <laughs> food science and research company, these products work. At this, I took my lunar wrench. I took my defense this morning. So the products work. I also took that acupuncturist, whatever it was, because whatever this was, was bad, but I have the relive. So I don't, you know, I still create content every day. I got to go. I love you all with the love of Jesus Christ. I am praying for Cat Condo. Everybody agree with me in prayer. Cat Condo, this job is yours if you want it. If you want it, it's yours. Amen. If you want it, it's yours. We're happy, we're blessed, and we're free all the time. We're going to stay free within the systems that obviously already have control of us. Even if they, nothing changes, you're still going to be free in my with my strategies. Amen. Free in Christ, free in your mind. It's not necessarily free from everything. I am not a prepper. I'm not off grid. I don't think a lot of people can do that. They can't afford it. If they can, I can't afford it. I'm st stuck right here. Amen. You're not stuck. You're, 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 you're separated, right? So change your language about your circumstances and you'll feel better. I love you all. I got to go. I got to go put Energize Go in this and get out the door. Pray for me. It's cold, rainy, crappy day. We're going to go see the horses after this. Praise God. God brought me those horses and God is providing for those horses. So, you know. Just know, guys, no weapon formed against you and I will prosper. Every tongue that rises against us shall be proven to be in the wrong. If you need the declarations, I will put the link to the declaration video below because I know you need I know you need that more than you need anything else right now um, because it's their holiday right now. There's not a lot of news, but I will still do a summary this afternoon. OK, God bless you all. Have a great day. It's it's interesting that in the midst of this RV thing, 
that comes out to distract everybody. And it's distracting everybody. Stop being distracted. God is good. You're under the covering of the most high. Cling to him. Amen. God bless. I got to go.